it going? Hi, this is Fancy Face with Aloha Adventures. Um, today marks my one month anniversary here in Honolulu. The video is sponsored by <laughs> the Kraken Black Spice Rum. Thanks, Benny. Thanks. Um, Show them the boots, your outfit. Oh. So I just wanted to go for something that was fun and a little festive, so that brings a cowboy boot. Something simple because the jeans are obviously bright colored, so a black top. And my signature blank key, my destiny key. Um, yeah, we just had a few shots here, and that's about it. What has been your best memory this first month? My best memory this first month? Um, I think First Fridays was really fun, because it was the first time we went out. Um, so probably First Fridays. Just because it was a good group of people, and we had a, a really good time dancing, and I saw how weird people can be who are messed up on drugs, and or have been drinking since 2 p.m. What are you looking forward to this next month? The next month, working, working, working. That's for sure. Working, making money, we're moving upstairs, so um, there's only a few more weeks worth of videos inside this space, um, which I'm also excited about because we get a really great view of Honolulu the windows. And what has been the least favorite thing about moving here to Hawaii? Least favorite thing? Um, least favorite thing. I think when you first move anywhere that's new, you are... There's always kind of a worry because you don't know many people. You might only know um, a few. You might only know one. You might not know anyone. And it's always very difficult because you have to get used to the culture and the people, which I actually like the people and the culture here. And it's very laid back and the lifestyle is really nice. The weather is really gorgeous, but um, you have to spend time like making friends and building new friendships. And as you get older, um, they the friendships and the relationships that you take on happen to have sort of different and or deeper meaning, meaning um, than when you're in your early 20s. So they're not as fun and frivolous and wild and carefree. You have to be a little bit careful in your life. And so that just takes its time. And I'm very impatient. Um, but yeah, it just takes time. Any last, last words? Yeah. Um, um. Sorry, this is off the cuff, folks. We like to keep it live. If you could summarize time. your experience in Honolulu in three words, what would you say? Thus far, I'd say relaxing. Um, actually, let me take relaxing out and say therapeutic. And free. That's there's, two. There's a sense of freedom here. Um, what's the third one? Sand. <laughs> because I still have sand in my hair. I can feel it. I still have sand in my hair from when we went to when we went on uh, uh, King Kamehameha. King Kamehameha. King Kamehameha Day, which was Tuesday. Today is Saturday, June 15th, and I still have sand in my hair. And I have conditioned, and I put my head under the um, regular shower head. I put my head under the bathtub shower head, and I can still feel some sand. <laughs> And there's sand in two or three of my bags. <laughs> sand underneath my suitcase. So sand has to be the third and final word. Um, but I am definitely looking forward to the next month because we've got Fourth of July, our housewarming party, which may be a Mad Hatter themed event, which is going to be fun. And also my birthday. Yay. Um, my last year in my 20s is upon me. So that's exciting. But so thanks. Until next time, checking in, checking out.